Emily saw us in the lobby last night. What, here at the Lakeview? Yeah, when I didn't come home right away, I guess she must have decided to come check on me. <sighs> Great. She must have lost it. Yeah. It was all I could do to keep her from packing up and walking out. And we're talking like major damage control. So what did you tell her? I told her that you had lost it, that you couldn't stay away from me. So she thinks I'm getting a restraining order right now. Not that Emily thinks that that's going to work. She keeps saying she wants to take matters into her own hands, and I don't even know what that means, Meg, but it, it really frightens me. Okay, I can handle Emily. Are you sure? Because I'm not even positive that I can handle her at this point. I mean, this morning, I, this morning was a nightmare. What did you mean exactly by... Uh... Major damage control. I did what I had to do. I think I threw her off the track, you know, at least for a little while. You slept with her, didn't you? You know what? Forget I even asked you that. Emily's your wife. I mean, it's not my business what the two of you do in private. Yeah. Like you said, I, you did what you had to do, okay? I, I don't want to talk about it. Look, the, the, the reason I called is uh, because I think I know what this key is used for. Really? Yeah. I spoke to my mother, and she said they looked like the type of keys used up in the farm for chain padlocks. Chain padlocks? Yeah. I, I don't know if this means that Dusty's anywhere near a farm. No, no, no. Hold could... on. Wait, wait. Stop. Okay? I'm going to handle this, all right? There's no reason for you to figure out what happened to Dusty. I thought we were working together. No, not anymore. I need to get you out of town and away from Emily. Right now. Look, I'm not gonna run and hide. I'm not afraid of Emily. Well, you should be. We both know what she's capable of, and now that she thinks that you're obsessed with me... Look, all this means is that we just have to hurry up and find out where she's keeping Dusty. No, I told you I would handle this. Look, Meg, I'm gonna feel a lot better knowing that you are someplace safe. I'm not going anywhere, so drop it. There is nothing Emily could do that is worse than what she's already done, and there's nothing worse that you could do to me either. What does that mean? Nothing. Forget it. I didn't make love with Emily. We, we just had sex. Is that supposed to make me feel better, Paul? Because I don't think it's working. She packed a bag, okay? She was halfway at the door. Emily was gonna leave. I had to do something to, to convince her that I wasn't cheating on her with another woman. You know, I, I had to make good uh, on the uh, Paul, honeymoon. Paul, you don't have to explain, okay? I have no right to ask you about any of this. Look, I... You know, I, I, I only did it to, to throw her off of your track. I appreciate it. I'm not so sure that it's gonna stop her, though. I could hold my own against Emily. You can. I couldn't. Dusty couldn't. Well, I want to see this through to the end. What's at the end, Meg? I don't know, Paul. You told me.